how is it going beautiful people smart and i'm back on your screen right now so i'm going to give you my unbiased opinion on shiba inu because you might want to stick around and watch this video through because you know if you don't know you don't know and if you know you know uh there is a saying like that so you might want to stick around you get the point right just so you know shiba inu that you've seen right here uh is currently tanking the free falling zone that Shiba Inu is currently trading right now. So anything can happen. Is Shiba Inu going to zero? I can possibly say that because you know we are in we are trading, we are currently trading in no man's land. You know, there is no support that is going to support XRP to take it back up again, ladies and gentlemen. So this is on a monthly time frame. And just so you know, we closed within that zone previous the previous month. So October is looking very very bearish. So if you close like this, October candle close like this, ladies and gentlemen, XRP is going to be trading in no man's land, and you know there is no support that is going to support XRP back up again from a what a monthly time frame perspective. You get what I'm saying, right? So is XRP going to zero? Ah, I don't know, I don't know. But you know, with chart patterns, we can actually decipher the most likely point that XRP is going to what trade to. You get the point, right? So let me draw something right here. Yeah? So, you know, this trend line can help us since, you know, we don't have any, you know, any support zone again. So all of this trend line can help us. So no man's land, you know, we can actually come to this zone right here. Yeah? You see that? And actually come to this zone right here. Yeah? You know, trade to that zone then, you know, then probably react yeah uh, it will most likely react to that zone because you know shiba you know i believe shiba you know is still going to what tank to the downside ladies and gentlemen i'm not here to sugarcoat anything to you that's exactly what is going to happen you get the point right so this is on a weekly time frame and i'm seeing what a huge level of bearishness when it comes to Shiba Inu, a huge level of bearishness. So I'm looking at, you know, this zone that, don't worry, later I'm going to talk more about, you know, Shiba Inu, that's why you want to stick around. Um, I'm seeing this level right here, you know, 500 zone. I believe XRP is going to come test this zone right here. All right, so this zone right here, I believe XRP is going to test this zone, All right? This zone, right. 500 zone, yeah. I believe XRP is going to make a retest of that zone then. We'll still need to see some reactions before we call Shiba Inu. I believe Shiba Inu is going to make a retest of this 500 zone. I'm going to be watching Shiba Inu uh, keenly because uh, this is actually, you know, a very scary place for Shiba Inu to be. I'm, I'm not going to lie to you, you know, very, very scary. It's not like other, you know, coins that we've, we've called long or called short. You, you get the point, right? But this has been consolidating for a very, very long time. Remember, I called short this move. If you remember, that's a very long time ago now. It's not now. That's a very long, this move right here, I called short this move. Uh, people were saying that uh, buy XRP, buy XRP. I said, ah, XRP is tanking to the downside or based on price action. And it would say tank to the downside, it's as simple as that. You know, if you know what you're looking for, you know what you're looking for. Uh, you get the point right. So that, you know, the reason of, you know, all the short analysis, you can actually see what the buyers and the sellers are doing. You know, and with these candlesticks that are, you know, currently forming right here, you can know whether XRP or Shiba Inu Bitcoin is about to blow to the upside or is about to turn to the upside. It's as simple as that. Very, very simple, right? So, uh, I'm going to, you know, sit on my hands and watch how Shiba Inu is going to play out. You know, you get the point, right? So, if I want to subscribe to the channel, definitely stick around, you know, subscribe to the YouTube channel. And I'm smart, definitely going to see you on the next one. Peace out.